welcome to this week's episode of My Shadow's Light. All is revealed. Now, um, if you haven't watched last week's show, there's no point watching this week's show. So we're not going to do a recap. We're just going to jump straight back into it. Last week, stuff happened. If you didn't watch it, go watch it. <laughs> yes. Oh my God. Yes. Yes. Uh, <laughs> yes. Yes. So we pick up with Kai. With no. n- we're going to pick up with Nova. You're on the bridge. Rika yeah. is on her way yes. to you, leaving the captain and Yellow in medical. Yes. Isolated. Isolated sealed. in and not sealed. going out. No That's leaving. Correct. That is correct. That is correct. You are being hailed by the Admiral's ship. Yes. Do you respond? Uh I'm going to send Daisy, ask them for two minutes. <laughs> she keeps delaying. Have, <laughs> Just have, two minutes. Have further two minutes? Yes, two minutes. Would you I'll like put me on to... the timer? Would you like me to run a timer? Nova, yes. so that you are aware of how long two minutes are. Uh, n- no, it's fine. I, it's figurative. It's figurative two minutes. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> Put him on hold. Yeah, it's, it's pretty much what's happening. <laughs> One moment. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Music. Uh, I'm waiting for Rika to get to me. Okay. I'll be there shortly because it's actually pretty close. It is. You I go wanna... the stairs. You go through the doors. Yep. I do want to say something to Till or, or Captain Ohu before any of this happens. Okay. All right. Go for it. We're sitting there. We're watching um, whatever show. Which What show is it called? The Alien and Me? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I, look, I look over to you and very casually... He's sitting next to you, and it's, it's pretty comical because I'm gigantic and you're little. And I look down at you and I say, you know, if you're um, if you're actually no longer Ohu, that's all right. I'll follow you. Okay, thank you. Um, I, I think I appreciate it. Yeah, I knew you would. Yeah, for sure. Knew you would. Great film. Very on the nose. Rika, you arrive on the bridge. Yes, Nova. Um, so we're being held by the Admiral again. Uh, we have a potential problem that I need to run by you because I need your assistance in doing so. Um, mm-hmm. If whatever has happened to the captain has spread the worm, I realized that if it takes over or it can control Ohu, he has, or it has, full run of the ship if the captain has full access. I would like your help and assistance in removing his override protocols until you deem him safe. And the only way we can do that safely is if the two of us agree to do so. Understand I don't want to. Understand I have no desire for anything bad to happen. But logically speaking, if a creature got into his mind and is running his body that we cannot detect and we do not know when it takes over, it will literally have full control of the ship and our lives. The Admiral is hailing us again, Captain. (laughs) Uh, First Officer. (laughs) Captain, (laughs) wait, First Officer. (laughs) Right. (laughs) I know it's not easy because I know, oh, who saved your life and you owe him a life debt. But if something's happening to him right now, you could also be saving his life and understand full privileges and everything would take, be given back to him the moment you, as our medical advisor, an understanding of things that are much like this creature, deem him safe to do so. Would that be all right by you? Give me a D12 check, please. 10. 10. Is this with um any, like... No, uh, no. You can put, put put points into it if you want, but I would like to sink five spiritual into it, so it'll be fifteen. <laughs> okay, so fifteen. Yes. She really wants your job, Till. Wait, can I? <laughs> I don't want one... his job. <laughs> can I, I just want us to all be safe? Sp- 
spiritual into your role. <laughs> Rika. Can oh I God. put points in? I mean, I, I, I... same. Yeah, <laughs> I'll throw it in there. <laughs> <laughs> when he goes back to talk to you, you're gonna do it. Uh, Rika, Rika stands silent for a while for uncomfortably long because there's an admiral blink light <laughs> yeah but then she says i understand your reasoning talk to the admiral okay and i will think about it of course but we would have to do it together with the ai um when if you do agree okay understood all right sorry to bother you rika and then i'm going to hail the captain the admiral or the captain the, the admiral sorry the admiral of the other ship what seems to be causing this delay uh we're doing further investigations the the infection the the creatures that we have found for some reason don't register on our bio scanners com- properly uh, what is registering, like, when the creature was arrived, it sh- it registered as the being it was living in, not what it is. And we our bioscanner still can't exactly pick up its biomolecular... Uh... Rika, help me. What is it? The biomolecular um, compounds of its makeup. The bio- is that correct? Chemistry. The biochemistry. Thank you, Rika. Um, so we're having a hard time confirming what is going on and you might as well by the way uh no no, well the i think it would be on me but i'd be like looking over at the camera (laughs) (laughs) i should probably not be standing there we have some form of bug on board hi (laughs) it's a it's a it's a it's a hollywood communicator so it only shows the face of the Ah. person talking it's 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 not a zoom switch right (laughs) yeah this is my home look at my games (laughs) all right (laughs) I am concerned by all of this talk of infection, and uh, I do not think that a freighter of your capacity would have sufficient medical resources aboard. I think it would be best if you were to dock with our ship. We will quarantine the entire vessel and then run complete medical scans. You were might you able be... to quarantine those on your ship? Your entire vessel will be under quarantine. But yours, yours, the signal was coming from your cargo bay. Yes, we have identified the individual who was responsible, a petty technician who signed aboard this vessel about a week ago. He All shows right. no signs of any kind of infection whatsoever, although he does appear to be a fanatic. He keeps repeating over and over again that it is time, it is time the Risen have arrived whatever that might mean. We are going to conduct severe psychological testing on him at an appropriate time. He was holding a device that we are unfamiliar with. Our technicians are, of course, going to examine and explore it. It does seem unusual, however, that both our ships should come here at the specific time frame, as if it was perhaps a predetermined this speaks to a larger conspiracy which we will not resolve by simply talking to one another across space. Your ship will stand down and prepare to be taken into our holding bay. Of course. Um, uh, can I relay that back to my captain, sir? Yes, of course. Um, so I'm going to actually turn it off. Look sure. at Rika and like, do you think he's also been infected? There is no way to know. But should I agree just... that we should have the have access to a bigger ship that would help our scans hopefully but what if they're all zombies in that (laughs) case we are dead anyway or we could jump and quarantine ourselves until we can figure out what's happening that would mean we would not be able to help the captain well we could bring in an other ship that we know is not infected we know has the capabilities of registering what's going on and then they would be able to help us, so we wouldn't have to worry about what's happening. Because if they're all zombies or we can't trust them, Nova, we're all a, screwed. It's a great idea, but we have the Sijeti on board for what? Hours? Yes. And he turned into a pile of worms. But he was controlled if, before that, correct? Yes, but if if the captain is infected, 
he might very well be a pile of worms by then. But we jumped here and it took us six hours to jump here and it was already infected. So yes, we would technically have six we... hours to jump at least to the Dwarfishian Empire to get someone to help us. Now you're thinking with your heart, not your head. When That's we true. are demolecularized, we are not processing through time. He was frozen just as us. <gasps> but if he was frozen in time, wouldn't that buy us time? That would buy us time to get to somewhere where we know they had the resources to figure out what's going on. Technically. Rika, you're a genius. And I, I, <laughs> I'm just the jump button. <laughs> I'm just like, Rika, 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 you're a genius. Where? So you would know a lot about stuff because you're a brilliant person. Where would be the best place to take the captain to get him the help he needs? Anybody can make me you either. don't an... want to know. <laughs> Are you going to tell us to go home? <laughs> No. Well, it's just between those two, so hey, yeah, we're watching that's Netflix. True. That's true. Uh, you could either give me a xenobiology or an astro, uh, not an astrophysics, a quantum drive check. Um, do you? I have quantum stream. Yeah, uh, quantum stream. That's it. Sorry. Do you have any pluses in anything, Rika? Nope. Unfortunately, I do. I have a plus point. two. My roll was terrible. Okay. Um, oh, I only have a four. I might take us to someone who knows, but okay. that's the limit. All right. But that would buy us time, right? Yes. Are you okay with this planet course of action? Because no. as I see it, <laughs> no. I don't think there's any good thing we can do right now. The problem is the one I know is in Cesian space. It. And I'm not sure you know much about my people. But you do, and I trust you. Yes, and why do you think I left? Um, okay. This show's great, Captain. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that one, There's that so much drama! reminds me, I feel but like regardless. this is exactly how Nova would act in that situation. Like, <laughs> trustful, faithful, um... <laughs> True that's why friend. I made her that's exactly yeah. loyal that's to a fault. Sure she, like second in <laughs> that's command. That's why I made her, her second captain, officer. Making sure she never betrays you. Oh, I mean betrays <laughs> yeah, I that feel person. Like... <laughs> is this technically metagaming? No. <laughs> no. I feel like in it's the Big Brother were voting captain's... someone off the house. <laughs> yeah. Do we have do we have captain? Do we have safety. a toilet in the medical bay? Uh assuming so. you can pee in a beaker <laughs> if you want. There are evacuation uh cups, yes. Just Stick a catheter up, you'll be fine. Well, that's part of it, yeah. <laughs> but yes, there is a waste reclamation processor. Okay. There are also escape pods. Ah! In the medical bay? Why? Yeah, okay. because the injured cannot travel. I will show you the map. Uh, so, yeah, they are. Right. There are two medical bay and the bathroom facilities, as a matter of fact, they are nearby. I was lying to you. There they are. Oh, no. Yeah, but they're locked in there. <laughs> yes, they are locked in here. Yes, but there are rudimentary um, ablution facilities for patients who might be in here for a long time. There might be adult diapers in there. <laughs> I'll wear them. You can oh. miss me. Worms. All right. Yeah. So yes, while these two are debating, Captain and uh, 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 Yellow, are you guys going to do anything other than just watching the show? Well, not for now. I feel like. We're there's not much is, you can do yeah this well at least i'm not i'm not worried to to any extent right now because we, we've been sitting here for probably 30 minutes and yeah. and i'm still waiting i i'm still convinced that nova will let us out eventually um can or i do, at uh, least it's great go ahead yeah no no or at least tell us how we're going to proceed because i want to get back to the helm yeah. um so no i'm i'm just probably cutting short on 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 the drinking i have been doing in here because i realized that the toilet is outside yeah. um yellow uh, i'm gonna do a physical science check and see if i can not immediately override but do the calcs to override the magnet uh the magnetism because i know how the uh Shigeti did it so i'm just gonna do it more efficiently i rolled an eight uh mm -hmm. and so i can override the door when it's when it's time 
Oh, that sure. Is. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, 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 yeah. Short circuiting the door is, is easy, especially since the face plate's still exposed. Perfect. Yeah. No problem. In the meantime, Rika has agreed very reluctantly that for his own safety, the ship must be transferred to someone else's control. Okay. <coughs> Betrayal. <coughs> <laughs> So it's for I'm your own super safety. If you're infected, <laughs> I need you safe, not flying into danger. Just sounds like a super trader to me. Yeah, that's what it sounds like. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so we're gonna hail Miss Daisy together. I know how high, hive minds work. Okay. Yeah. So you're I'm gonna, gonna go hail Miss. Yeah. I mean, we're going to initiate the revoking of his override protocols and captains. Or whatever, uh, whatever extra stuff he could do, we're going to override that for now until he is deemed safe. Am I, to, am I to understand that as chief engineering officer aboard this vessel, Rika, you comply with the first officer's assessment that the captain is no longer able to operate this vessel? Yes. First officer, dun, dun, dun. do you agree that the captain is no longer capable of operating this vessel? Yes. Since the two of you are present, I must therefore assume that this is a accurate assessment of the situation. I will, however, ask the captain. As you wish. Captain. Yes, Daisy. Do you feel that you are in full command and capability to command this vessel in your current state? Uh, well, of course, it would be more helpful if Nova would decide that I can return to the helm. But um, other than that, I'm absolutely fine. Why? Why are you asking? Given the current predicament of the uncertainty as to your quarantine, if you are in quarantine for a significant period of time, your ability to control the ship would be impaired. I agree. I agree. That's why I need to get out of here rather soon. But you agree to the quarantine terms? I agree to the quarantine terms until we have figured out if there is a, necess a necessity for a quarantine here. So I would say for, let's say, the next 30 minutes, 45 minutes, we can continue this scheme before we then quarantine. just... Okay, sure. Very well, Captain. Thank you for your responses. The uh, Miss Daisy is no longer talking to you, um, uh, Captain. It's now just to the two uh, in the uh, AI oh, room. Shit. The captain has agreed. He is incapable of operating this vessel whilst he's in quarantine. I will now transfer all control of the vessel to First Officer Nova. You now have the capacity to override the captain's 30 minute time limit. I override it. <laughs> override accepted. Miss Daisy? Yes. How do we return the bower? to the captain later by It'd the same simple. process same process understood i will hold you to that nova of course captain nova I, I feel i should inform you that the briannese ship is maneuvering to load this vessel into their cargo bay okay so i'm going to message captain ohu oh yes yes um we're having a problem with the Briannese ships where they're saying they want us to dock with them, but we have no idea if they have also been overrun with the infection, and the fact that they're trying to force us to do so is worrying. Would you suggest us moving to another location where there's people who could help us that we know are unaffected? Um, Should I continue the course we originally planned? So, come again. They are, they are trying to they're trying us to in. force us they're trying to force us to dock in them for a quarantine where we're just as fine here if we were quarantined and we don't know the state of what's going on with their ship 
I was suggesting that we would go somewhere that is safer. We know that no one has been infected and quarantine there and have their medical professors and medical uh, um, people come and help us with their better biomechanical machinery. Yeah. Can I, Jim, I would like to ask you quickly a question because to me, like, so to me, it would seem that the best way to quarantine someone in space is not pulling them into their ship, but just leaving them in space. Um, so does that, is that probably because they have force fields or whatsoever they can use inside the ship? So this is a regular procedure. This is not something that puts me off as shady in the first place. No, because the Briennese warship will have the most sophisticated medical technology aboard and you are just a freighter. If yeah. this is something that could potentially be a major galactic virus of some kind, the best way to contain it would be to contain it in the most advanced system that they have available. So, yes, this does not sh strike you as being shady okay. at all. Okay. And the, as far as I have understood, the vigilance is... Um, what, what type of ship is it? I think? It's, it's not a... It's a battleship. It's the largest it's ship that they have. Correct. Yeah. So they have quite a good medical facility. They would have state-of-the-art medical facilities, yeah. yes. Okay, in that case, I would I would be like, Nova, um, I feel like, I mean, you've put me into quarantine here and I would like to get out here as soon as possible. If you're jumping away, this feels like it's taking quite longer for me to get out than to have them run the tests and confirm that I'm okay. That's true. But my only concern was if they were also infected. Oh, hang on. Captain, I'll get back to you in a moment. There, there's just one moment and I, I'm going to close the thing down. Rika. Yes. If whatever this little bug thing is, oh my God, this is literally just a problem. They would want, he would want to go to their ship too. So I don't know why I'm asking him. I have I have something I want to say to yes, now. Yes, but <laughs> it, the you. request also makes sense. Okay. Because it is the closest medical facility. So All right. I, I have I, an idea. I have an idea. I'm going to hail the admiral. The All right. Ship. I'll come to you now. Yellow, what did you want to say to, to the captain? So I said, she's acting real funny. Yeah. yeah. You know, like I mean, maybe you you really think she, she's not doing anything funny, you don't think, right? No, I feel like she's on the edge. I feel like she, I mean, that's a bad situation for her. And I'm the captain and I'm in quarantine. I'm pretty sure she wants to have me cured as, as soon as possible. Um, although I feel like. Hey, Miss Daisy. Yes, yellow. What is the current rank of Ohu? You're an asshole. <laughs> As if he would figure that out. He has a very good psychology. He oh, will figure that no. stuff out. The current rank of the individual known as, and I can't read his first name because it's too small, Artean? Art, 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 Artias. Artias Ohu is civilian. What? <laughs> Nova! Yes, Captain. <laughs> I've got here. We're getting here weird, weird readings on on the uh, command structure of that ship. Um, of the admiral you... ship? How did you get that? No, God, I of, know. of our ship here. Like, can you please confirm my rank on this ship? Yeah, just give me a second. I'm busy with the admiral. <laughs> <laughs> And, and as soon as she hangs up, I'm going to say, she's playing you. So, Rika. You want me to speak to the captain? Rika. Yes, Rika. You're most... No, well, yeah. Yes, Rika. Tell him what's going uh, on. Yes, Tito. The whole. <laughs> Rika, and, and both Yellow and I are getting really weird vibes from Nova here. Like, have you... Has she taken over command? Temporarily, yes. And... She, she is also under a lot of pressure. But yes, for your security, if you have been compromised by some 
hive mind worm, you have the potential to deal a lot of damage to this universe by having control of this ship. So until we have guaranteed that you are not, you are relieved of command. Okay, I understand. And I think that is to some extent sound reasoning. Um, I feel like though that she's trying to run away with the ship instead of getting the medical attention you both think I need. I agree, which is why we haven't left yet. Yeah, so please, if possible, um, help Nova a little bit to calm down. I think she's probably a bit over-projecting the situation. Um, and, no shit! <laughs> and give her the guidance she needs, uh, Rika, um, so that we can get this sorted out. Because honestly, I have to pee. Understood. Oh. The Admiral appears before you, Nova. Admiral? Yes. Our concern is that with the compromise of your ship as well, that it might have spread beyond the one being. We would ask that you hail another medical ship to come here to quarantine us. Given the proximity to the altercation happening between the Sujeti and the Dwarf Ash, that seems... Im... It is simpler for you to come aboard. You will be isolated within a containment field aboard our vessel. We will then dive directly to a secure military facility where all necessary medical precautions will be taken. Which medical facility? I will show you on the map because it's the only way that I can also see the map. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we will be transporting you to Tull Alpha. Can you show me the map now that you've said it so I, can, I know where we're going? <laughs> Tull Alpha. Oh, right that's really top. far. Uh. That's a lot further than where we're going to go. Okay. It is the largest military medical facility that we have. Okay. Um, I so call the check. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, can I, can I oh test to see if he's being... The metagame uh, just came out of my mouth. <laughs> I, I ping <laughs> can I uh, Nova do... and say yes, agree. Can I do a psychology check? You can, sure. Because I'm worried they're just going to take this thing and run. Seven plus, where's my psychology? I have it marked, so zero, but seven. So you think he's being honest? You do know that Tull Alpha is a very large military uh, planet for the Briennese. Uh, you seem to recall there being large amounts of pr prison facilities there, as well as, as obviously they're going to have medical, they're going to have a whole variety of, of things there. But right. yes. Um, so I will agree to that. I'm like, all right. Uh, I agree to the terms. I would ask that we remain on the ship. And then when we get to the facilities, I would like for my crew and I to remain together and not be separated so we can know the state of our our friends whatever is happening aboard your ship will dictate what happens once we get to Tull Alpha Very whilst well. we are en route you and your crew are in quarantine if any of, of you attempt to disembark your vessel you will be executed immediately of course uh, I would also mention that we picked up two Dwoveshian survivors on our ship um, so it's the four crewmates and two Dwarveshians. You had Dwarveshian and Sajeti soldiers aboard your vessel at the same time. What? Yes. I didn't see. I said that we had one Sajeti that took over stuff that was in by this bug thingy, and then we had Dwarveshians, but they had dampered with our systems. The Dwarveshians tampered with your systems. No, the Sajeti. Did you not pick? Did you not pick any of them up when you scanned us? I'm trying to play it like the Sajeti fucked up the systems. So we should have seen it. <laughs> Our scans did not reveal any additional life forms apart from the original four crew. All right. So 
There is four of us. There was Captain Ohu, who has been relieved of his command because he's been infected. There is myself, who's first mate Nova. We have Rika and Yellow. And then we have two Dwarveshians as well on board. We're going to keep them all contained into different areas for quarantine. Why did you tell him my name? I don't know. It's just so they know. I don't know. Admiral, if you have any advice, it'd be great because they're all new to this. <laughs> Stand do we by. Hear any, oh, he yeah, closes do the we hear any of this? No, it's not being piped through. Yeah. No, it's just Rika and I at the, yeah. the, the bridge. Mm -hmm. Rika, what are you doing with this information? He closed the channel. It's the first time the Admiral's cut the call short. <sighs> I don't know. R Rika. I mean, I am paranoid. <laughs> but I would look over, I'm like, sorry if you didn't want him no to know your name, but once we get to the military facility, they are going to see what you are. Yes. Which, if you're concerned about them knowing what you are, then maybe this, we should have I thought of that before. I am concerned how they will treat me. Yes. I am as well. But that's why I asked to remain with you, so that way, if anything happens, I can try to help you. I do not believe my name is very well known outside of the Asian <coughs> Empire. So hopefully that didn't mean anything. But, but I if am you feel concerned threatened. at him reacting that way to my name. I hope you feel it's simply because he heard it's an, as you call it, alien name. Yeah. I'm sorry, Rika. I'm really trying my best. I know this is hard for you. At least you didn't pronounce it correctly. I'm sorry. What? While well, we're watching Netflix. Yeah, gonna... the captain and, and Yellow are effectively <laughs> stuck there. If, yeah, if you guys... I, know... I'm going to pop that door open. And then I'm going to sit back down. I was just going to go down to you. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. You, you you open the door? Well, I'm, yeah, I told you that before I wanted to know, and you said it was an easy task. So Absolutely. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. So I just walk over to it, and I pop it open, and I sit down next to him, and I said, book, it's in your court. Yeah, thank uh, you. I'm still going to go down there. And I'm going to page the captain <laughs> as well. Oh, I was just or the captain. just about to call you. Okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. So I'm like, all happens as Rika's leaving the bridge. Hello. Like, Hello. <laughs> Uh, so I'm gonna make page captain. As yeah, well. uh, you're paging captain. yourself. Yes. No. Oh, no. You. You. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the civilian known as Ohu. <laughs> but when I page, I'll be like Captain Ohu. You should be like civilian Ohu. I mean Captain Ohu. <laughs> yeah, Nova. My um, ship. I mean your ship. Captain Nova. I must say. I'm. I'm sorry. I'm. I wanted to, you are always my captain, sir, and I'm still reporting to you. I just, if something happens to you, I needed the override protocols to not be in your hands. And I really do hope you understand that. No, it's fine, Nova. Just, just get us out here. Yes. So we are boarding uh, the, the Admiral's ship, as you advised. They are going to be taking us to the military facility on Tall, uh, what's the one guy? Tall Tal Alpha. Tall Tal Alpha. Alpha. Wait, where they're going to to where so they can quarantine us and check with their machinery no no no, no wait 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 they're taking us to to toll alpha yes that means they're... that they're not performing checks on us on their ship but they're towing us to their medical facility and look you're the captain it's your call but i feel like they're pulling us right into their bow and i don't see that they are going to let us go rather soon i thought you wanted this sir well i, I thought they, they they would just run a few scans and confirm that i'm fine i i, I no, don't they're feel going to very take comfortable us... about being being well take being captured and pulled into a military medical facility where they can run tests on us also keep in mind we have rika on board i know i've already spoken to rika about it as well we while so we're, I think we're going to be going into their, their 
thing. We're going to be quarantined. They're going to set a field around us. And then we're, they're going to jump us to a medical facility where they have even better resources to take care of you because you want yeah. the speed and expediency of this. But we're not going to fight out of there if we're in trouble. Like if they have us in there, in their station, we're in there. Yes. I feel like I feel like this kind of is a change of the situation. I feel like you should jump before they're pulling us in. All right, sir. Um... How about that? How about we pause the whole quarantine thing for, let's say, an hour, and I help you, and Yellow helps you, and we're, first of all, we're sorting the situation about the vigilance that is now trying to pull us to Tall Alpha, and after that, Yellow and I will go back into the medical bay, and we can run more tests on us, but this is, I feel like... As soon as we have spread to everyone. I mean... Um... <laughs> would yeah. never do that. Um, <laughs> Just when you're sleeping. <laughs> right. Mm, what if we were to transprint Rika so they're safe? Would that make you feel safer going to a medical facility because we'd have no reason to fight our way out of it? I'm afraid you may not Where's leave the space? bridge, Rika. Sorry, what? You may not leave the bridge, Rika. Thank you. The quarantine has been breached. The area around the bridge is now contaminated. What do you mean the area Excuse around the bridge me. has been contaminated? Good job, guy. Okay. <laughs> I was wondering if you think <laughs> I'm going to run down there. I was already on my way, but now I'm going to no, run you down there. You haven't left the bridge yet, because as you walk up to the bridge doors, that's when Daisy says, you cannot open these doors, Rika. Oh, I see. The quarantine has been breached down there. The primary door's Captain. medical has been forced open. Captain, did you force the medical doors? Well, technically it was yellow. Um, and I feel like he was just getting a little bit um, nervous. Okay. Yellow, still in try medical. to remain calm. We are going to go, uh, Captain. If he's going to freak out, I think the best thing to do is to get into the ship and be as honest as we can. I... No, I'm good. I just didn't like that you just arrested control from our captain. He's still Without our even captain. Having a group vote, you know. We, I was there. Look, we were there. We could all have this conversation together. Everyone, Yellow. everyone, Daisy. everyone. Time out. Time out. Hold. Um, <laughs> so. Oh my God. Nova. Yes. Contamination has been breached. It's absolutely useless to lock us in there, although we aren't technically locked in there. We're just sitting there because we want to be polite. Um, we are now in dire situation where we are possibly being dragged to a military facility, which I do not like at all. You're saying that I'm still the captain, so why don't we pause this quarantine game we're playing and just return to normal business, jump out of the system, and then resolve this issue right now. One, One moment, moment, I'm going to hang up. <laughs> <laughs> Rika, they breached it! Do we just go? What do we Hold do? Up. Calm, calm. <laughs> Daisy, Daisy, confirm one thing for me. Yes, Rika. The tunnels that run throughout this, this ship, they do reach the bridge, right? That is correct. In that case, this entire ship is now the quarantine zone. That is incorrect. When the medical bay doors were breached, I erected force fields around the bridge area protecting you. We still don't have access to the rest of the ship, though. That is unfortunately a byproduct of being isolated from the medical ward. Understood. I would just suggest going onto the ship and dealing with it, because now the rest of the ship has been quarantined, and the whole ship's quarantined. I think we should just get on the ship and deal with it unless you want to jump and hail someone else to come get us, Rika. It's your choice. You're the one in the most threat right now. As much as I would like to be safe, um, <laughs> Tido Ho saved my life. It is only right that I risk mine to save his. I will try I to stay. protect you as best I can. We do not have time. So All right. I stay. All right. Um, Miss Daisy, if you can lock down everything, um, 
so that they can't leave anywhere else like like so they can't get up to the bridge that'd be great the bridge and that they can't get to the uh lock down all uh entrances into the engine rooms um and escape pods and i'm unable to lock out escape pod access that would violate several treaties of the intergalactic all right but don't policies. let anybody into uh the the engine rooms or anything and we're gonna let we're gonna dock nova once we are docked in the battleship i believe we are going to be clamped down and stuck we won't be able to leave i understand Look, I can pee in the corner and I got like pillows and stuff so I can sleep here. I'm okay with this. I just want the captain to be back to normal captain. I want Yellow to stop being crazy and I want you to be safe as best I can get you safe. This is a shitty situation. I'm the only one who understands. That's the problem here. <laughs> the Admiral is hailing the ship once again. I'll open communications to the Admiral. I would like you to submit your crew records if you don't mind, First Officer. Uh, of course, Admiral. For what what uh, reasons? You've put us in a rather tricky situation. How so? We were on routine patrol when we came across a vessel. The vessel in question registered as having four occupants. Subsequent to encountering this vessel, not only do we uncover an individual aboard our vessel using unknown alien technology to signal said vessel, but then we discover that said vessel had somehow managed to alter our scans, hiding the presence of not one, but two different alien species currently engaged in a border skirmish. That yes. would be suspicious, do you not think? I agree. Then, instead of agreeing to coming aboard our vessel in a civil and, quite frankly, I thought, rather suggestive manner, <laughs> suddenly a virus appears which has infected your captain. No, I, t I mentioned before that he was, it, he was in quarantine from it. Your captain was going to come to me aboard his shuttle. And we're coming to you now, but he has yes. been revoked of captain authority, so he can't override anything because we think there's a possibility that this could be a hive mind situation. Will you willingly transfer the files of your crew to my vessel so they might be checked? Of course. Uh, but I will tell you up front so there you understand that while other people have been tampering, that I am being truthful to you. Uh, we do have. So you a... do agree that others have been tampering? Yeah, the Jetty did. I told you this. Why would he mask the life signs of the Dwarf Ash? Probably trying to just mask himself. I don't know how it works, sir. Apparently not. I, I'm just a pilot, sir. Well, I we've taken the the authority away from the captain. Technically, now I'm a captain, but I'm not actually a captain, sir. I'm just a pilot. <laughs> um, but I wanted to tell you up front, we do have one of our members of our crew which is Cishan. So you are aware, so you're not surprised. <laughs> this, guy, this guy's just like... He's like, over there. <laughs> what? Um, uh, I can't. Dead. I'm so sorry, everybody! I'm, up. <laughs> it's fine. I'm done with this ship. They're gonna I'm find going out to, anyways. They're I'm gonna not find going out to anyways. mention that we technically stole the ship. Um... <laughs> I, I didn't like, steal a ship. Super <laughs> you stole yeah. the ship. He, uh, he closes the communication. The mm -hmm. vessel is waiting for me to transmit the crew files. Should uh, I comply with the Admiral's request? Yeah, go ahead. We're fucked. <laughs> <laughs> or you can just press a button and leave. I'm a captain for five minutes and it's all gone to hell. <laughs> jump, 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 jump. Captain Nova, you are aware that these files indicate certain activities as to the ownership of this vessel. Oh. <laughs> I was always oh. part of No, but I was always part of the crew and I was always the pilot. Yeah. Yes, but the captain was never Captain, you misunderstand. I am not judging you for your actions or inactions in the mutiny of the previous cap 
the previous <laughs> previous captain or the previous captain captain of course just transfer the files because this quarantine and this could be a galactic problem let's just comply i'm wearing the face mask people Oh boy. We're still not getting any of this, right? We're still like... No, <laughs> no. 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 You would have if you hadn't broken <laughs> the door. It's, yeah, if it's... we, if we, like, if it's we have like... left the Met Bay, because I feel like Yellow and Ion are strolling through the ship. Um, sure. How far do we get? Sure. Really? <laughs> You're not staying in quarantine? <laughs> But the door's open, and apparently the whole ship is now in quarantine. That's true. That's true. Actually, I'm, technically, I'm only in the, the bridge. bridge is in quarantine now. <laughs> it is I'm locked in the bridge, having like a mental breakdown. I just... want to go check on the dwarves. <sighs> oh, gosh. Uh, so you uh, try and leave medical. Uh, the door to the hangar bay is locked. And... Um... Do I have to roll for this? Well, it's not locked for you. Oh. Perfect. Because there's no quarantine in place here. It's locked for the captain. Well, for Ohu. So you can override with chief engineer. not authorized to walk through doors. Yeah. yeah I'll, I'll well, that was, Nova's, that was Nova's order. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's just keep going. No but I've good. already said to lock down the ship. Yes, to lock down the ship. That's correct. For civilians, that's what lockdown means. But the crew can still move through. Chief oh, no, the chief engineer can still override. No, and lock down the ship. <laughs> <laughs> that means everybody but me and Rika. I'm a tactical officer. You kind of right? didn't sure give that list of everybody but me and no. Rika. It was just locked down the ship. So the ship okay, is locked if the, down. The ship is locked down. I'm right. The bridge checking. is locked down, right? And, and, and the engine room. This. I said the engine rooms to be locked down. Yes, you did. That's but correct. Again, you said locked down. Yes, the ship. So yes, uh -huh. there I'm is. I'm gonna go find the dwarvesh and help. And like, and and when the door opens for me, I'm just gonna hold it open for the captain. We're gonna go together. <laughs> is that when you're headed <laughs> yeah, to the like... dwarvesh? Yeah, I just want to check on see how they're doing. <laughs> Oh my god. All right. This is this is all gone to shit. This is this is what happens, folks. This is what happens. One I should little... never be a captain. I think everything's fine. Why is everything's fine now? here? I don't know what's going on. No. Um while we're going, I would like to I would like to at least try and call Miss Daisy and say, Miss Daisy, um can you give me an update of the current situation? Um, because I feel like there's a lot of confusion going on here right now. The Brini's battleship was initiating docking procedures. Those, however, have ceased. Further information is unavailable to civilians. Do we are we in the process of initiating a jump? That information or... is off limits to civilians. Hey, Miss <laughs> Daisy, yellow. my my best friend. Yes, yellow. What are we doing right now? <laughs> I'm not sure. What are we doing right now? Are we jumping or no. are we staying? I have transferred all of the files of the crewmen aboard this vessel to the Admiral's ship. So she just transferred all the files that implicated you as the mutineer of this vessel before to the other ship. Oh, brilliant. Um, <laughs> I say casually. <laughs> okay. Nova, 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 do you, do you read me? Okay, Nova, I feel like this situation is getting out of hand a little bit. Um, we are not going to be quarantined. Um, we're going to be locked up for, because, you know, you remember the drunk captain that we left behind where we took the ship and just yes. left? Yes. By galactic law, this means we have performed the mutiny and everyone involved will go to a trial. Um, and... Or we took back the ship from the mutineer since he did it to the previous captain and we're looking for our captain. Which um, captain? I, I'm not sure because you're captain right now. Who, who, the one before <laughs> you, the one before the captain you stole it from. Hey, uh, you know that what they used to do to people who used to betray their own kind and the slave pens I used to be at? Well, they just, they say they had a trial, but really they just had a rope and a short drop. And that's what you're making us do. Oh God. Ms. Look, Nova. Look. I think Again. honestly is the best policy at this point because we're just fucked. 
Well, and well, if we stay here, we certainly are, because even if we get a fair trial, it might be a trial that takes several years. Whereas I'm still, I still want to point out that Rika is not particularly a species that people know of or that people want to have around. Um, so we are not trust. only or trust. So we are, we are. We are mutineers on a stolen ship with um, a season on board and very, very, um, well, let's say unclear status on who we are, what we do, what we want to do. And we are in really bad situation. So I would highly, highly recommend that you jump now. Guy, well, the best this part is, going is on. this captain is I wanted to jump in the first place and you didn't want to do it. And now all of a sudden it's a problem. I am going to go scan and see what the hell the, the <laughs> Brenya ship is doing. All right. I want to so, see what the ship is best doing. Part is every time he's giving me advice, I've followed it and it's gone to shit. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, Rika, you are you are doing your, your scan. The Brenya ship is arming weapons. Get out. <laughs> Yellow, what do you do? Oh, I'm just going to go check on the dwarves. Yeah, all right, I... so you, you get to the dwarf Ashians, uh, uh, whilst this chaos out. is They're going They are arming on. weapons. Nova? They're arming weapons? Yep. yep. Yes. I'm jumping and I'm going to dive the ship. I've already had everything set up on the system and to go, I'm just going to jump in my seat and dive. And I'm not going to go to the first stop I plotted out. I'm going to the second one. <laughs> all right you guys jump and there's that weird dislocation of space time as you are suddenly just printed across the uh the galaxy you as you're opening the doors you see the dwarf ashians looking over at you but then time stops as you as you skip across uh the the, the universe you pop out where Exactly, because you were going to go to Gregan, so you bounce from Gregan. You're going to go to Branagh Tire, all right? Yeah, that was the second location we were going sure to Sure thing, sure thing. You guys pop out on the other side. Boop. Perfect. Uh, Rika? <coughs> yes? Where would be the best place to go for a quarantine for a ship that has a bug on it? She doesn't mean you. <laughs> a virus not you you yeah i'm sorry i'm trying i'm stressed i'm i'm going to need a vacation after this just and maybe some favorite. drugs i need sorry. i need a release man hard <laughs> drugs do i know uh where in the dwarvash territories you would need to go in dwarvashian territories give me a xenobiology check the dwarf Eshin would know. in that case, because I did roll. <laughs> 12? Yeah, 12. 12? Okay. <sighs> Bringing up the map again, you... Well, Branagh Tire is a very large uh, planet. It has a big population. Um, what the situation is on the planet's surface, you're not entirely sure... Captain, we are being hailed by several Dwarvashian ships. Uh, oh, which one is the highest ranking order? I will put you through. Thank you. A Dwarvashian appears in front of you, looks you up and down on the hologram. You have entered into Dwarvashian space. I am Captain Nova. May I ask who I'm speaking to? Hi. What is your name, sir? I am... <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't Hi. resist. I'm Captain Leloch. Loch? Leloch, that's right. Leloch. You are currently registered where? Um, pardon? Where is your ship from? So we are a cargo ship that was running a um, just a mission, and we came upon the battleground between the Sajeti and the Dwaveshians. We picked up two of your Dwavish uh, survivors. Oh, you uh, did. We did, but 
We also ended up with Sejeti upon the ship that were infected by a hive mind bug. We have quarantined those who have been affected, which was the previous captain to me. And we are looking for assistance because we do not have the resources on our medical bay to determine what the bug is and whether or not our crewmates and Dwabeshians are safe. <laughs> Aye, all right, uh, fine. What? Stand by to be bonded. Thank you, sir. The Dwabeshians look at you yellow as you arrive. Are you all uh, feeling enlightened? <laughs> it. It's good to see that you're awake and uh, not suffering too much. Yeah, I'm feeling just peppy. I feel actually better than I ever have. Don't we, Captain? Yeah, we're feeling really good. Um, I think, uh, Yellow, they owe you something, right? Don't they? Oh, yeah. Two and three slaps. I'm ready. <laughs> we're, wait, is this the right time to do that, Captain? I feel like, like like now we should be going to the bridge to make sure none of these, well, none no, of no. these people have... That's right. <sighs> they take their helmets off and uh, square up as best they can with you. Do they look normal? Yeah. They look absolutely cool. fine. Great. That's great. That's what I wanted to know. <laughs> so <laughs> here we are. Okay. I take I take all of those. All slaps. right. You take all the slaps. <laughs> From outside the Dwarvashian ship slowly comes along and docks. There is a flashing communication. Um and then the Dwarvashians are requesting to board. Do they have hazmat suits? I am able to determine what they are wearing. However, traditional Dwarvashian spacesuits are isolating. All right. Um, I'm going to allow... I'm going to page the captain first um, of the Dwarvashian ship. Aye, this is the loch. We're ready to receive your medical team. I just wanted to make you aware that they, the rest of the ship, while the bridge is in quarantine, the rest of the ship has been breached by one of our members who went slightly crazy. Uh, he was a little mad that being quarantined. Um, so just be careful when you board the ship. Don't you worry. Thank you. I'm going to let them in. <laughs> um. Did we, Miss Daisy announced that we have been um, approached by the ship? Did we all hear that? She, like, was that, well, was that a, a general um, broadcast? The broadcast is that the Dwarvashian ship is initiating docking procedures and is boarding. Correct. Okay, so we know that as well. Yes. So in that case, I would say, well, Yellow, I think this is a good opportunity to, um, well, meet meet our our guests who are coming aboard probably talk census into into nova um why don't you go ahead i will just try to explain the situation to our trobeshians here all right captain I'll, I'll take a few more hits for you they say you need to drink you know sometime in the next five ten minutes i'm, I'm sure you'll be back yeah I, I i can manage a few drinks here um all right so okay. yellow you're heading off to meet the boarding party I'll, yeah, I'll go with him to meet the boring party. I think we've, I've dealt with these people after taking my hits. That's true. Rika and, and Captain, Captain Nova, you're still quarantined in the bridge. Yes, we will just yes. monitor the thing. All from right. And Ohu? Um, I would like to, well, briefly give them an introduction to what has happened. Um. <coughs> And uh, explain <gasps> them a little bit of of, of the Dwarveshians that might be coming <coughs> on board. He's sick. He's dying. <laughs> He's and spreading it. I would like to cough some of the spores into the air. <laughs> and that's where we end. Has the Dwarveshians become infected? And uh, who knows? Who knows what happens from there? Uh, <laughs> I'm losing my shit. I knew it. I knew it. I, knew it. I was waiting. Yeah, oh, absolutely. My body is ready. 
Oh my god. Yellow is it's like a, it's a really big me. problem being super. Oh my god. Knowing that something's going on and my character is just like, nope, I believe the captain. I am getting ready to just say screw it and coming over and shooting Ohu in Yolo. <laughs> it's too late now. You'd have to kill all the Dwarvashians too. Yeah. Not that. Uh, I'm just gonna blow up our ships. I'll just nuke us off. <laughs> just nuke it from orbit. It's the only way yeah. to be sure. Yeah. Anyway, that brings to the conclusion of this crazy adventure. Um, <laughs> I I I have to say I I. I didn't expect that particular outcome, but then again, never, one never does. And I was nervous about doing it, but I only allowed it to happen because I knew that you guys would be able to roll with it and hopefully have fun with it as well. Yes, absolutely. Absolutely. Um, I knew yeah. it. <laughs> I am <laughs> sure, Jeff. Theoretically, we don't know if these spores are evil or if they are like the harbingers. That's of true. Peace and love and understanding. <laughs> Likely yeah. not, but, but they could be. Tobias is on the, the level. He's getting. He's coming around. The Yellow King the has yellow spoken king. to me. And I mean, I'm, I'm an insect. Is it actually bringing... the Yellow King? I relate to them. <laughs> is it actually the Yellow King? God, I so, hope so. So the idea that I had for this entire adventure was that all that you guys needed to do was to get Zero away from the battlefield so that he could spread his contagen. And it was inspired very much by the Yellow King because I saw, uh, uh, I, I went and looked up the Yellow King and, and, and that sort of thing. And just this idea of these tentacle-like things I thought was, was super cool. So I was like, well, that's what's inside him. And he just needed to get somewhere. And you guys just stopped him at every point. And so then he <laughs> tried to escape and then you would catch him. But what was interesting was you wouldn't then... He was he was able to sort of weasel his way around things and 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 that sort of thing until eventually he had no option but to infect somebody. And I was like, well, whoever's closest, and that was Captain at the time, I'm afraid. So. <laughs> God. Um. And um. Yeah, I gave Till instructions as well. Well, yeah, and, and Till was instructions as well in terms of well, it takes a while for this stuff to grow inside of you. Um, it's slowly been eating him, hasn't it? But your goal is to get to a big population. And spread, yeah. And spread. Uh, whilst causing war and strife as well. Um, so, yeah. So what was going through your mind? Because I have to say, Nova, it has been a roller coaster of, yes, we're going to the ship. No, we're not going to the ship. Yes, we're going. <laughs> well, I mean, that's the thing, it's, because, it's, like... I he, because he gave us commands before. Right, I know, jump. I know. You were tying then, yourself up in knots. Oh, um, my God. So, so, and I was just having this proverbial like, meltdown. I, I, <laughs> well, I felt like um, <clears throat> the second... So so I was, I was... I absolutely loved the situation of being... being decaptainized um, <laughs> and, and, and suddenly stuck in that situation. Um... I knew that I want to like I want to spread the infection as far as I get, but it take it slowly takes over. So I felt like there is this point where I realized that being brought to a medical facility might be really bad for me because that might be a stop. So I was trying to to create a reasoning to not go there anymore. And I was hoping to play on the, we need to protect Rika. And, uh, oh no, the ship has <laughs> That's been what stolen. got me. And, um, and so I was, I was, I honestly, I was hoping that I could at least infect one of you, not just the Tuovesians, but you were, you were locked up so tight. Um, <laughs> Yeah. That it probably takes would take a few more sessions to get that yeah. to get that yeah. working. Um so I feel like it's 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 a really clever ending of where where you it's like this, it's it's like the aliens, right? Like right. the alien movie right? where all you it see reminds me is of hidden from 1984, mm. I think. Yeah, mm. yeah, for example. Um where all you see is like this ship drifting in space and someone gets infected and you you don't you just don't know how how it plays out later yeah um yeah yeah, yeah really cool. we have a whole new problem is there any oh who even left in you or is it just straight up this bug guy well at the moment there is but after a while eventually the whole thing gets subsumed by the host 
um, by it's by not the, good because everyone loves him. By the parasite. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But it remains in that form, quite capable to operate for for quite some time. Yeah. Um, uh, several weeks, as a matter of fact. You're um, horrible. <laughs> and, and and then so so yeah, uh, Rika, you were you were stuck in loyalties, and I know you were getting lots of die rolls going on. Your your GM was showing in terms of right, roll this for me, roll that for me. So well, I'll yeah, go but, for but it. It was like. I actually set up, I, I made a list of of what would influence her decisions. Ah. Like she's done a study. She knows it's a neurological hive mind. She has experience with hive minds. She has a lot of loyalty to the captain. She has loyalty to Nova for being a crewmate and also a woman. So I made a list of all the things and then I rolled for it. And then I had uh, Kai roll against that and she won so <laughs> but that still doesn't mean that i that rika would stop being loyal to the captain i still needed a reasoning that would justify it right and it was for mm. the captain's protection because if he's infected he can do a lot of damage to himself and to everyone else so in order to protect him and us so we can get him to safety we needed to needed to get him out of the way right. so it, it took some thinking to get around this complex web of loyalty that is the CG in mind, but I think it worked out well. Uh, but it was yeah. hard. <laughs> yeah. And and then Yellow, you were smiling from from the get go. <laughs> yeah, I just I just stirred the pot. I saw what you, I saw what was happening immediately, and I was just like, I'm just gonna make this worse. Right. <laughs> so I just right. kept yeah. kicking the can down the road <laughs> and making the situation worse every time. You're supposed to I, love opening me. the doors. <laughs> I absolutely love you. I just felt like I didn't want to be like disruptive, but I wanted just like every action I do, just like flick <laughs> till to go a little further or oh, do something that would screw over Nova. <laughs> I was actually surprised that uh, Till didn't me? infect you though so the thing is um i felt like i was thinking about because i was really scared of being possible to infect rika mm. i knew that because i could play the i'm the yellow king card um i i felt like i can i can rely on yellow following me um so even if because I wasn't sure if I want you to get out of the Dwarveshian um, room to infect them or have you in there and see what I am doing. I wasn't, I, I felt like you would have, yeah, would have accepted. Yeah, yeah, probably. You, you so, literally combined my two favorite people in one person. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So if and, you noticed when you made me cry and you broke me and then at that point of the last episode where I was like, oh, it all makes sense now. That's when yeah. I, I knew what so, I was going to do for the to, rest of the to, time. To 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 make a make an example here or, or similarities, I felt like I could you could be something like what, what do you call it? Igor to um, Dracula, <laughs> but <it's> still <laughs> oh Frankenstein. Um, so still the 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 the, the normal living um, link to the world. Um, I was going the for prophet. Nova, but it wasn't. I, Nova was. I was hoping to get. When her. you kept saying "break the quarantine," I was like, "No, that's not how this works." Yeah, but I felt like the only because Rika, I didn't know if I could infect her at all. I don't Probably know if not. that would have right, and that was my would future. have to get me out of the suit, which yeah. is obviously possible. But yeah, but yeah. the Dwabeshians um, are in suits too, but. You they took their helmets off. No, they took their helmets off. Which I we were not that. to. Yes, oh, but... no, the two in the room? I'm talking about the ones coming yeah. into the ship right oh, now. Oh, right, 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 right. Yeah, but the ones coming into the ship, you, as far as as far as far everyone's concerned, the captain is, uh, oh, who's the one that's infected? Yeah. So the other Dwarvashians, they're going to take into the medical bay. Everyone will be quarantined for sure. Also, but... I, if if we had them like if because yes. i i didn't have the time on my yeah. eyes yeah. um yeah. so i wasn't sure if we if we're going to have a dwarvesian encounter with them i would have played the look my first mate got mad she's just crazy we're all not infected and she, scan us. she lost yeah, yeah please yeah. scan us probably the scan wouldn't show anything no Mm -hmm. That was my play as soon as they, as they, soon as they, yeah. like, they, yeah. they leveled weapons. I was literally going to do that. What <laughs> threw me off so hard was that in 
in my game, in Synthesis of the Cataclysm, I have psionics who are able to do the opposite of this bug. They can hide from organics by affecting their minds, but they can't hide from machines. machines so this yes. was just this just threw me for a loop because I was in that mindset. I was like, so it can hide from machines, but not pee. How does this work? <laughs> uh, so Kai, because I have to admit a certain perverse delight in watching you break. <laughs> Not break, but to, to struggle through this and seem to have so much fun whilst doing it because there's so much excitement. It's so easy to, to 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 pick up on that. But what did you feel? Because yeah, what did what did you feel? Stress. No. <laughs> it was a lot of confusion because I knew something had happened to the captain. Right. And with Rika had mentioned, it's a ticking time bomb, and I was okay with going into facilities to get the help. Right. But they mentioned that Rika would be in trouble. And that was what threw me for a wrench. And the moment right. they leveled arms, I was like, well, great. Because I was all on board with being docked. And I thought we were still docking until mm -hmm. they leveled weapons, which is like, let's just be as honest as we can. Because everywhere we go within any of the empires, they're going to ask, who are you people? Mm -hmm. What is going on? So I was like, okay, whatever. Like, yeah, have the records. The best, like, we're criminals. You got us. But like, you know... Well, we're we're caught either way at this point. We're right? trying to save the galaxy here. Yeah. Well, yeah. I'm trying to save us too because we can die from this. Uh, we very clearly need help. And the one thing that tripped me was Rika, because I don't want to screw over Rika because Rika is the one who's been the only one I could rely on because I can't rely on Yellow. She's the only one who can help me take over command from the captain. If I want to keep command away from the captain. I need to have her on my side. And also Rika has been my, my crew. He's the only crewmate I have. I need to protect this, this person. Um, I don't know what's going to happen next time. I don't know if we're going to lock down the ship with all everybody on it still until we can get to a facility <laughs> in Dwabeshians or if we're going to, cause I feel like again with Ohu it's a ticking time bomb. How long it's going to mm. be till it actually eats him. Cause Nova actually really admires Ohu for what he did. Uh, so this is just as hard for her. I think a lot of people forget that that Nova also owes a lot of loyalty to him and and really admires him. And now there's this thing that's eating him. Um, so, oh, dear, and dear. I think it's probably the only person she's ever kind of been close with other than the person that was back on her the planet. Yeah, that's true. So. That's true. That's true. Well, I hope I I had so much fun. I love these kinds of games where it's I, cause, I mean most of the time I'm just sitting here. Occasionally I would just use Daisy to drop in a little bit of extra kick in a specific direction, which I really enjoyed doing. But also I was sitting here going. I'm the admiral of a ship. I come across this other ship in space, suspiciously directly away from a battle that's taking place. And they just keep lying and lying <laughs> and lying. And it's like, it's how lying. would how would this admiral react? It's like, okay, let me see their files. They're what? Uh, this is some long con. This is a ploy that's, you know, so, so I, I really enjoyed that little thing that was going on in the back of my head whilst you guys were busy doing your stuff on top of it all. So anyway, um, I, I thank you all for your time. I thank you guys all for watching. Let, let, what did you think of this whole thing? This is, this for me, this for me is really, if you've got the right players, and I think you guys are definitely the right players, this kind of scenario is so much fun to play out. Agreed. If you've got the wrong players, it would yes. be yes, exactly. Anyway, thank you all for watching. Thank you guys all for playing. And uh yes, we'll see you again sometime. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs>